Yeah, hello guys. Um, this is the from my phone clinic, and we have um Samsung J J three J three twenty seventeen. That is J three three zero F N. So um, this particular phone, actually, you can see it's night already because I've closed from the office, so I had to bring it home so um i'll be showing you guys how to bypass this stuff we have different steps of bypassing it um one we have other steps like you go through this place let me show you this is the major those these are the things i'm seeing online majority of this thing i want to show you this is what i'm seeing online in case if you see if you have phone like this and you've tried some other step or that trick of bypassing it and it's not going i'll show you how this one is doing you can see i've connected to a particular um, network let me next i'll show you guys something okay it's asking for the previous so let's go back let's go back trying to go back okay okay click on add network add network then you see from here we have settings this is settings we have um, keyboard and layout click on this place you click on key tab then then what again i think um sound and vibration yes these are the steps that which i've tried before and it's not working so the reason i'm showing you guys i want to show you guys something that is very very crucial that is very very important now we, we are going to enable this um press home key blah 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 okay this is all we enable not that one we enable this then let's click on it now normally you have to there's a way you do it that the system is going to crash so you are going to simultaneously you are going to press five seconds and customize so let me press it simultaneously with my two finger simultaneously no simultaneously that's what i want to do no i've not got it yet yes this is what i've done you can see simultaneously you can see what what happened it went back that's not what i want to do although this video will be kind of lengthy a little bit there's something i want to point out you can see this is what i want to point out on some videos online once you click on application info you can see it went back but on some videos online once you click on the application info it will bring out the what you want what you want to see are you getting me but on this is not bringing it out so if you have um, issues like this and you follow some step online those um, videos you've watched online and it's not bringing out those options now I will show you guys if it's if you are trying to um, view the application info and it's bringing you back to this um, to this um options to this um screen what you have to do is um let me just go straight to the point what you have to do is for you to download look at my system you can see download easy samsung frp tools make sure you download it so once you download it what you'll be doing just connect your um connect your phone to the system i've done it already but the reason I'm shooting this video is so that you guys can see. Let me try and connect. I'm trying to keep my steady. Okay. It's connected already. You can see it's telling me J3 2017 is connected. So what we'll be doing now is click on bypass FRP. So it will tell you that connect to Wi-Fi, blah 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 blah. So it's ready now. It's trying to read the port 
So once it reads the port, you can see it's going to send a kind of pop up to this phone screen. You can see there's a pop up. You see the pop up of it has, it has appeared. Now, this is the pop up. The pop up has appeared. Easy frame here. You click on view. So it's going to take you off from this page, from this, um, what is it called? From this menu. Now, what we have to do now is for us to not now, not now, remind me later. So what we have to do now is for us to type Google FRP bypass then you click on go this is it so now we'll look for i'm searching for something here there's something i'm looking for not tech point actually um, it's not here not this place this is not what i'm looking for this is not what i'm looking for i'm looking for google i think it's google manager from frp or bypass yes i've forgotten the website actually i've forgotten the website uh, oh god i don't know that is this this website it has list of who are you i think screen lock or so let me see if i can so this is where we are going to go we look for add room no 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 where am i going we go to add room add room let's search for it this add room click on it and see this whoa this is where you go this is it so you look for um screen smart lock then you open can you see it then you open so it's going to tell you to change you change let's use pattern required password when device is on yes when device is on you confirm then we select any pattern you want to you confirm again then you click confirm then you said i am in you click understood then you restart your phone that's what you do Restart your phone. So once you restart your phone, let's wait till it's completed. It's not something add. Like I told you, once you, once it take you to the um, internet, um, whatever, whatever because Samsung has internet um, browser so just so just search for add drum now it's telling me to enter the pattern that I use the other time I use an L pattern so so just go to the browser and search for add drum you click on add drum then you see the list of all those um, app when you see screen lock you click on open it's going to direct you to that particular place that you are going to input the password the pin or the pattern you want to use so let's wait patiently while it loads if you are new to this channel um don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe if you are a returning subscriber don't forget to like the, if you if this um, video is helpful don't forget to like and don't forget to share also so now i think the android is starting so we can now we can now set it up now 
you know, it's connected to a particular network. Network. What's this? I want to select this. Okay, next. Next. Skip for now. So it's connected to my network already. You know, I told you guys. I've already done the connection. So let's wait a minute. So something is going to pop up like pattern. Now it is the pattern we use the other time. That's why we went to input the password. So there'll be a kind of bypassing. There'll be a skip here, skip button at the left hand side, at the left hand side corner. Now you can see skip. So once you click on skip, the bypassing is done. Skip. Now our phone is being bypassed by this simple method. So once you have a system, if you've not used that a system to try this, make sure you download the driver, the driver tools for Samsung. After downloading the driver, you download Easy Samsung FRP2 2020 V2. So, once you do that, so the reason why we need the um, software is just for it to take us to the browser so that we can we can bypass the phone. So, all, all well and good. Our phone is being bypassed. You can see our phone is working properly. So, our phone is being bypassed. So, guys, um, if you love this video, don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe. This is the Type Mobile Phone Clinic.